NASA officials insist they're close to announcing how they plan to bring Commander Butch Wilmore and Sunita Williams back down to Earth. And I don't think we're too far away from making that call. Um, uh, we're, we, we know that uh, at some point we need to bring Butch and Sonny home. And liftoff of Starliner and Atlas V. The duo launched into space bound for the ISS on June 5th aboard Boeing's Starliner. During docking, thrusters went down, making a return trip impossible. The veteran astronauts may hitch a ride on the Dragon spacecraft, made by none other than Boeing's aerospace competitor, SpaceX. We have set up the, the Dragon for Crew 9 to have flexibility to have uh, only two passengers fly up on that flight, and then we could return four crew members uh, in the February 2025 time frame. Yes, a potential departure date of 2025. Astronauts that are not in a dire situation. This video shot just this week captures an unmanned resupply of the space station. I'm sure they're enjoying their time in space. You know, you never know when your next space mission is. Not only did Colonel Terry Verts command the ISS, he knows what it's like to have his mission unexpectedly extended. He spent an extra month in space. It's a bummer for the families. You know, the families are who I always think of. They, they had plans for the summer and for the new school year. Despite the plans and the works, there's no return date. No make and model for the spacecraft that will eventually bring them home. As an American, I hope that Boeing succeeds. It's important for NASA and for America that Boeing has a successful mission. In Seattle, Sebastian Robertson, King 5 News.